So, tuloy natin yung ating naputol na video sa ating example number 1 para sa volume of solid of revolution. So, recap tayo kung ano nangyari sa ating last video sa part 2 natin. Ano? Ating video. So, example number 1, find the volume of the solid formed by revolving the quadrant 1 region bounded by the graphs of y equals 0, y equals minus 2, and y squared equals x about the x-axis. So, una, ang ginawa natin, sketch natin yung figure. No? So, ito yung naging figure niya. So, gari nun, yung axis of rotation natin ay yung x-axis. So, nirotate natin yung plane area sa x-axis. So, ito yung nabuong solid. Ano? So, yung part na yun, from 2 to 0 or from 0 to 2 ay uh, ginamita natin ng circular disk method dahil bawat slice sa uh, lugar na ito ay circular disk. Ano? At uh, nakakuha tayo ng volume equal to 2 pi cubic units. By the way, yung part na yun ay tinawag natin volume 1. No? Tapos naman, yung part naman na ito, from 2 to 4, dahil ang bawat slice dito naman ay circular washer. So, para sa volume 2, ginamita natin siya ng washer method. At dito naputol yung ating video no, sa washer method. So, ito yung ating naging formula, no? So, pi uh, capital R squared minus small r squared times the thickness. So, yung A natin 2, yung B natin 4, yung thickness natin dx. Yung capital R natin no, is defined by uh, the, para, the parabola, no? y squared equals x. Tapos yung small r na ba natin, yung, volume, yung radius ng butas is defined by y equals x minus 2. No? Ayan. Kaya nagkaroon tayo na r equals y unit or y units which is equal to x raised to 1 half. Ano? So yung small r naman, y units na din siya equal to x minus 2 naman. So, sinubstitute natin sa formula. Ito, ano? So, nagkaroon tayo ng volume 2 is pi, the integral from 2 to 4 of x raised to 1 half squared minus x minus 2 squared dx. Tapos, sinimplify natin. At, ito na tayo, ano? Pagyari natin masimplify, 5x minus x squared minus 4. Integral of 5x minus x squared minus 4 dx. So, integrate natin. Integral of 5x dx equals 5x squared over 2. Integral of x squared dx equals x cubed over 3. And integral of 4 dx equals 4x. Now, si evaluate natin from 2 to 4. No, from 2 to 4. So, when, una, when x equals 4. So, lahat ng x papalitan ng 4. So, times 4 squared. No? And then, minus 4 cubed over 3. And then, minus 4 time, times 4. No? 4 times 4. Okay? Next. When x is 2 naman, so I'll have 5 over 2, and then times, so when x is 2, so karoon tayo ng 2 squared. And then minus, no? so when x is 2, so karoon tayo ng 2 cubed over 3. And then minus 4, and then times 2. Tapos kaya rin yun, sisimplify natin. Ano? So, tawag tayo ng volume 2 equals pi. No? So, 4 squared 16 divided by 2 ay 8 times 5 ay 40. No? 
So, wala, meron tayong 40. No? 40, yan. Equal sa 40. Ulitin ko, ano? So, 4 squared, 16, divided by 2, 8, times 5, equals 40. Next. Ha? And then, minus 4 cubed over 3. So, 4 cubed equals uh, 64. No, kaya magkakaroon tayo ng 64 over 3. And then, minus 16. Uh, so, 4 times 4 equals 16. And then, minus, ano? Uh, so, 2 squared, 4 divided by 2 ay 2 times 5 ay 10 times negative. So, magkakaroon tayo ng negative 10. 2 cubed ay 8 divided by 3. So, 8 over 3 negative times negative magiging positive 8 over 3. No. And then 4 times 2 ay 8 no? Times negative, negative 8 Times negative, positive 8 Okay? How is he simplifying at 10? So 40 Minus 16 Plus 8 or times 40 and then, minus 16, minus 10, plus 8. So, 8 plus 40, 48, minus 26. So, that's uh, 66, you know. Uh, 22. Oh, sorry, 22, you know. So, 48 minus 16, 22. So, 22. And then, you no. Know, so, negative 64 over 3 plus 8 over 3 equals 56 over 3. So, minus 56 over 3. Yeah. So, I repeat, no? 40 plus 8 is 48. And then, 16 plus 10, 26. So, 48 minus 26 equals 22. And then negative 64 over 3 plus 8 over 3 equals negative 56 over 3. No. Kaya rin doon, si simplify natin. So, pi. Kuha tayo ng LCD. LCD natin, LCD natin ay 3. So, 3 times 22, 66. No. 66. And then minus 56. So, equals, you know, so, 66 minus 56 ay 10, you know? so, 10 pi over 3 cubic units, you know? so, ito yung ating volume 2, so, volume 2 natin equals 10 pi over 3 cubic units, okay, next, so, yung total volume natin, equal siya sa volume 1 plus volume 2. No? At ang volume 1 na nakuha natin by circular disk method ay 2 pi cubic units. So, sa substitute natin, ano? 2 pi cubic units. So, volume, total volume equals 2 pi cubic units and then plus volume 2 na 10 pi over 3 10 pi over 3 10 pi over 3 cubic units so magiging total natin meron tayong LCD na 3 no? so 3 times 2 pi ay 6 pi and then plus 10 pi. So, 10 pi plus 6 pi equals 16 pi. No? So, we have 16 pi over 3 cubic units. So, this is now the total volume. This is now the answer. No? 
So, volume natin ay 16 pi over 3 cubic units. So, ang naging volume, total volume na yung buong solid ay 16 pi over 3 cubic units. Ano? So, yung volume na ito, yung volume 1, ito, equal siya sa 2 pi. Ano? So, equal siya sa 2 pi, yung volume nito. Tapos, yung volume 2, naman, equal siya sa 10 pi over 3. So, ito naman yung volume 2 na ito, 10 pi over 3. Okay? So, yung total volume natin, para sa problem na ito, B1 plus B2, no? B1 plus B2, ay naging equal sa 16 pi over 3 cubic units, ano? 16 pi over 3 cubic units. So, ayan yung sagot natin. 16 pi over 3 cubic units.